The developer behind a controversial project in Little Italy has a new project in the works. This one is in Hillcrest, and while it is expected to further revitalize the neighborhood, some are worried about making an already tough parking situation even worse. In just a few months, this construction site will be home to a new high-end seven-story building that will house 29 lofts, seven office suites, and a restaurant. People who live nearby seem to have mixed feelings about it. I'm happy it's going up. I think it's really bringing a, a fresh look, a fresh face to our neighborhood. Um, it's great for the community. It's great for Hillcrest. It doesn't make any sense if there's not enough parking already for them to be adding more people to the community. Parking is a big problem in Hillcrest, but the developer and architect's son, Matthew Segal, told me this building will have about 60 underground parking spots. The Segal firm is the same one behind the controversial proposal a few years ago to tear down this iconic pink building on the corner of Pacific Highway and Hawthorne in Little Italy. Built in 1941, it has had many lives as a nightclub, motel, and a couple of restaurants. Seagal initially proposed an apartment complex, but nearby residents, businesses, and historians said no way. He sold the property, and now a six-story hotel is going up. As for the lofts on Park and Robinson... I'm very excited about it. Barber Carlos Salgado expects it will bring in new customers for him and the rest of the community. Hopefully it will also increase the pedestrian traffic. Uh, which then people will be able to see the different building, uh, type of businesses that area and then begin to use them. Now, Seagal told me the project did not need a public hearing because of the small amount of units being built.